this is Ranger Rob and welcome to the Ranger Rob Country Living Channel. And yes, I gotta say it, it's another sparkling day in Central Oregon. This never stops. So today is kind of a busy day. Uh, we have our my sister-in-law coming down, Jay Lynn, and uh, I'm gonna get her on video a little bit more of this this uh, visit. She'll be here for four or five days. Uh, I do have to get the uh, fifth wheel uh, prepared for her and get it all cleaned up and making sure it's all spiffy and uh, switch out the water and get on the gas and all that stuff. And uh, <laughs> last, last night was kind of bad. It was about 11 o'clock at night. I'm going, I think I hear water running. And it turns out I, uh, you know, I run the hose in the dog's little pool and I forgot about it. And uh, Lord knows how much water I wasted. I feel bad about that. <coughs> but uh, it is what it is. So uh, we caught it at least. Could have been worse. I could have found out just now. So uh, <coughs> everything looks in, looking real pretty in here. Going to turn on the water for the corn. Go check on all the systems and see how we're doing. Well, today I decided I'm going to fertilize the corn. I'm going to run about 70 gallons of nutrients into the corn. Um, I'm filling the tank with water for the second time. Added the nutrients already. When it's full, I'll turn on the pump and I'll pump it all into the corn. And uh, corn still looks like it's doing pretty good. Uh, I did put a lot of nutrients into the uh, potatoes and some of the plants over there. And then as soon as we're done there, oh, I did fill up some tanks again over here, uh, including the swamp cooler. And I have a lot of tomatoes to do again. So, uh, so as soon as I'm done, <laughs> with filling that tank, turning on the pump, we're gonna harvest some tomatoes today and probably some green beans. And I think I get some roasting peppers that are ready to come. Uh, they've turned red and it's ready to go into the house and we're gonna freeze dry those to use with all of our different recipes. So busy day, still haven't got to the trailer yet. So yeah, let's just keep moving. Well guys, it's time to do some harvesting. I grabbed a couple more buckets because um, I got a feeling I got a lot of tomatoes to pull. So let's pull some tomatoes out of the greenhouse. Okay guys, so we did pretty good on tomatoes. There's a few that I'm gonna let go one more day. But I also gotta pick some, pick some beans here. Our season's almost up on these beans here, so we got probably one more harvest. So let's get some of those. All right guys, we got a pretty good harvest of uh, tomatoes and uh, green beans. Of course, my audience is here. Val, Cinder, come. Come here, come. Sit, sit.
We always got to feed the helpers. Later on this, uh, probably tomorrow, we'll be uh, starting to pick peppers. Uh, I may pull these red peppers down here today. Uh, look at these green beans out here. Oh, some big green beans. Uh, yeah, I better pick some of these too before I go in. And uh, we also are getting a lot of banana peppers. So uh, yeah, we'll be picking banana peppers and we got a whole lot of purple beans to, uh, to uh, harvest too. So I'm sure glad Jalen's showing up. We need some help here. Well, it's also time to pick up some eggs. I haven't got eggs since yesterday afternoon. So I got a, few, got a feeling we're gonna have quite a few. Let's, uh, let's take a look. That was a lot in that one. Let me gather those. So I picked up six eggs from that side. This side ought to be loaded pretty good. Hey guys got a really nice load of eggs here I already took the tomatoes and stuff into the house I'll bring all this in have a little lunch process this stuff and then uh, we gotta work on the RV so we had a pretty good harvest lots of beans lots of tomatoes eggs and uh, there's a lot more out there to get we get the rest of those by tomorrow Okay guys, we've been working on the RV a little bit. So the first thing I normally do is actually our RV is pretty uh, pretty tight as far as uh, getting critters and stuff like it. However, uh, usually before we have guests, I uh, normally spray the uh, RV off with a a spider killer and things like that. I really don't have too much problems here, but it's probably because I constantly do uh, take care of the, uh, sorry, uh, of that. And also all the corners of my slides, I always spray with a bug killer. And then uh, I'll let that sit for a few hours. Then I'll come back in and hit it with Febreze so it doesn't smell like insect repellent. And uh, I went to fill up my uh, water tank and realized I didn't drain it last time. So I'm draining it right now. Got the hose ready to go. We'll refill the tanks, turn on the hot water heater, turned on the gas, and she's ready to rock and roll. Uh, this this uh, RV is like a, it's like a second house. And now that I have it on a 50 amp plug, everything, air conditioning, everything can be ran normally without putting stress on the circuits so that's a good thing uh and i'll probably vacuum again and then because of these fuzzy dogs especially this german shepherd right now i've got to vacuum the whole house because uh, uh i call it defuzzifying <laughs> so uh anyway guys so busy day uh, got all my green beans packed up in bags and put them in the refrigerator. Uh, moving around tomatoes. And uh, I got tons of tomatoes. So this weekend we've got to do something with tomatoes. Uh, so yeah, all kinds of good problems. Well guys, I think I did my hardest work today. That was vacuuming the house. Uh, I think I sweat more doing that than I do doing all the chores in the yard. So anyway guys, uh, now that my water is drained out of the RV, it's time to fill it up again. So I'm heading on, heading all over here. Got to turn the valve underneath where it drains to close it again. Fill her up and then uh, get the rest of the systems up and running. All right, so I got the, val got the valve all uh, tur uh, turned to close. Just got to head over to the garage here, turn on the water. It holds, I believe, 40 or 50 gallons. 
of water. And then uh, when that's done, uh, turn on the hot water heater. And uh, yeah, that'll be that. All right, guys, we got the uh, RV all set up and uh, just fed the dogs. And uh, getting quite cloudy and a little breezy and definitely smoky here. But yeah, I'm done in today. So uh, Jay Lynn will be here about seven o'clock. Today's Friday and uh, we look forward to having her here. And we have a lot of projects to have her participate in. We're gonna domesticate her really quick. So anyway guys, I wanna wrap it up here. Thank you very much for watching. Please take the time to like and subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Sharing our videos truly helps. We appreciate it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. So guys, have a great weekend. Talk to you later. Bye. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.